Happening today, Miami's police chief Manny Morales is speaking out about alarming claims after a former employee accused him of corruption and racism. CBS Force Peter Den joins us live from Coconut Grove in Miami City Hall with what the chief is saying about this. Pretty strong words from the chief, Peter. That's right. You know, one of the officers claimed that Chief Manny Morales used his position to open investigations to target employees. But Morales, as you noted, is fighting back, saying that is not so. Morales told the Civil Service Board here at Miami City Hall there was no retaliation against the officers. Lieutenant Brandon Lanier and Officer Wanda Jean Baptiste, seen here with her South Florida PBA attorney, have said they were suspended and transferred to other duties after reporting about corruption and racism in the Miami Police Department. Now, Lanier had been director of internal affairs until he was transferred to duties in Overtown a year ago and then put on patrol last October. Morales said it was important for his reputation to speak out. The only thing that I, I, I've been waiting is for today. It's easy for any officer to put allegations and put words on a piece of paper when they feel that there's no consequences. But let me tell you something, Peter. Words have consequences. And their actions and their falsehoods and the lies that they're putting in there that they're, they're going to be unable to prove out here today will have consequences. You've always felt that you try to run things fairly. You've told us that. In the Absolutely, past. man. You do the right thing for the right reason. And what I, what's happening here is individuals that violated departmental policy, violated officers' rights. They didn't do the right work in internal affairs when they got held accountable. They strong accusations, right? Now, Morales said Lanier was led astray by the previous administration and even failed to attend meetings. Right now, as we speak, Lanier is testifying, giving his side of the story, saying there's a pattern of how he was treated unfairly. At this point, it's not clear what the Civil Service Board is going to do. Some subpoenas for people to testify have not been served. We are live in Miami City Hall. Peter Dench, CBS 4 News.